Let's start. Today we will see how to align the content in the Flexbox. In the body tag, we have a parent div tag with the class name, Flex Container. And inside the container, we have three div tags. In the style tag, we have written the CSS. This is the style of the container div tag. The justify content attribute is set to center, so the content of this container would be aligned center horizontally. There are various other options like center, flex start, flex end, etc. And this is the style of the three div tags. Let's run this code in a browser. As you can see, the green colored layout is the flex container. And the three div tags are aligned center horizontally. Now let's change the justify content attribute to flex start. As you can see, the content is now at the start of the container. Now let's change the justify content attribute to flex end. As you can see, the content is now at the end of the container. Now let's change the justify content attribute to space around. As you can see, the content is now placed with equal space around them. Now let's change the justify content attribute to space between. As you can see, the content is now placed with equal space between them. Now let's see how to align the content vertically. For that, let's set the container height to 200 pixels. And the content height is 100 pixels as before. Let's run this code in a browser. As you can see, the content is not aligned vertically at the center, instead, it is stretched. Now, let's set the align items attribute to center. Let's run this code in a browser. As you can see, the content is now vertically centered. Let's set the align items attribute to flex start. As you can see, the content is now vertically at the start of the container. Let's set the align items attribute to flex end. As you can see, the content is now vertically at the end of the container. So that's it. That's how you can align the content in the flex box. Thank you.